my brothers, my sisters, God is real. God is so real. That's right. God is real. God is real. God is real. That's right. God love for you is real. God love you so much. God love you so much. God love you so much. God love the world so much that it's in his only begotten son that whosoever believe in him shall not perish but have eternal life. That's how much God love you. He sent his only son, Jesus Christ, that whosoever believe in him should not perish but have eternal life. Jesus really died on the cross for your sins so you can have life and have it more abundantly. What more abundantly mean? They mean you truly have eternal life. That after you leave this shell, this body, this skin, this flesh, that you truly have eternal life in heaven. You can have life more abundantly by being in the presence of God Almighty. Where you will have no more hunger, no more sickness, no more diseases, no more worries, no more stress. But eternal peace and happiness and love. That's what God wants for you. Yes, the first man Adam sinned and separated us from God. But God loved us so much. God loved us so much that he sent his son to be that sacrifice so we can be reconnected unto him. He made the ultimate sacrifice for you and for me. God is real. His love for you is real. That's right. Jesus love us. Jesus love us. Jesus love you. He died for you. You call on his name with faith. And he will heal your body. You call on his name in faith. And he will provide. Believe. Because God is real. His love for you is real. What do it mean to truly believe in God? It means believing God's word. Accepting his grace. Accepting his son as your Lord and Savior. Accepting his gift, which is his son. That's God's mercy upon us. That's his grace upon us. Trusting and believing in his word. Believing that you know, if you live a sinful life, that the wrath of God is real, that you will be punished. But believing that you live a righteous life, according to God's word. That you will be rewarded in heaven with eternal happiness, eternal peace for all eternity. No more sickness, no more hunger, no more worrying, no more stress, no more pain, no more suffering. That's God's gift. That's truly believing. I believe God's word that if I live a sinful life and I die in my sinful ways that I will go to hell. I know I will. But I believe in God's word. If I live a righteous life according to God's word. That I have eternal peace. Eternal life in heaven. That's believing. That's believing. God is real. His word is real. If you are not right with God. Get right now. Because no one know the time, day or hour when Christ is coming. No one know the time or hour when it's your last day on earth. Because while you're here, this is the only chance you have to get right. Because once you leave this fleshly body, judgment is set. You're going to go to hell or you're going to go to heaven. Believe in God's word. God has spoken. The only one can separate you from God's eternal love is you. You have to make the decision. The devil can't make it for you. God gave you free will. The decision is up to you. Where do you want to spend all eternity? 
believe and trust in God's word. If you accept Christ. And you turn your life over to God and you follow God's way. You will go to heaven. But if you deny Christ. And follow the devil and live a sinful life. You will go to hell. The choice is yours. It's all real. God is real. Jesus is real. Heaven is real. Hell is real. The devil is real. Demons are real. Angels are real. It's all real. It's all real. Do not be fooled. Do not be mistaken in thinking that it's not real. The choice is yours. The choice is yours. God is real. God is so real. God love for you is real. Jesus Christ is real. The sacrifice of Jesus Christ down on that cross because he loved you is real. Angels is real. Heaven is real. Eternal happiness is real. Eternal peace is real. Being in God's presence and love for all eternity is real. It's all real. The beauty of heaven. When you heard people who had near death experience went to heaven and came back and told you the beauty. It's all real. But know what else is real? Hell is real. The devil is real. Demons are real. The hatred that the devil got for you is real. He hates you. Because you are created in God's image. Because God loves you. He hates you. It's all real. Demons are real. People are really being tormented in hell. It's real. It's all real. As they're being tormented, demons are laughing at them. It's real. I'm not here to play games. I'm here to tell you the truth. I'm not here to tell you what you want to hear. I'm here to tell you the truth. I'm not here to make you like me. I'm here to tell you the truth. Because your soul depends on it. And what I say must be the truth because I got the answer to God for that. So I will always do my best to lead you in the right path. I will always do my best to tell you the truth. I'm not going to sugarcoat nothing. I'm not going to lie to you. If you're living a sinful life. And you die in your sins. You will go to hell. But if you repent. Of your sins. And make Jesus Lord of your life. And accept God's gift and believe in God's word. And line your life up according to God's word. You will go to heaven. But you must truly believe in God's word. Because God searches your heart and your mind. Truly believe God's word. Believe. That God is always with you. He will never forsake you. God see everything. He knows everything. He knows what you're going to do before you do it. But God is talking to you. He told me. Trying to talk to people all the time. They just don't listen. It's time to listen. Don't wait until tomorrow to get saved. Don't wait until tomorrow to make Jesus Lord of your life. If you are not saved. And you know you are not. I urge you and I beg you to get saved because it is real. It's all real. God truly loves us. God loves us so much. God don't wish to send anyone to hell. Hell wasn't created for us. It was created for the devil and his demons. But many men and women decide to follow the ways of the devil. So therefore they will be punished. As the devil and his demons. But those who decide to follow the way of the Lord. 
will receive a reward and a crown. A reward of eternal life in heaven with God. And I'm telling you, when you feel that love that God has for you, when you feel that love God has for you, the love and that power of God upon you, the peace of God, it's a feeling that's undescribable. And I got a glimpse of it. It's a feeling that no one on this earth can give you, not even your mama. It's a feeling that's so peaceful and so love. And I know now why they shout in heaven 24 7. Because being in God's presence gives you an energy that you cannot describe. It's that love that God gives you. You feel like you're the only one there. That's the God we serve. Like all his attention is just up on you. But he loves you so much, he makes you feel special. He lets you know that you are special. That he created you for a reason, that you have a purpose. And I really hope people who see this video really get an understanding of what I'm saying. It will be a day when you're going to be judged. It's going to be a day that I'm going to be judged. Give right. Not just with words. But by your actions. Truly get right. Truly accept God. As your Lord and Savior. Accept Jesus Christ. Turn your life over to God. And get right. Walk away from sin. Repent. Repent is not just sin. Forgive me. When you repent, you sin no more. You do your best not to sin. You humans, you're going to make mistakes, but you do your best not to. You turn over a new, a new life. If you repent because you was committing adultery, you don't do it no more. If you repent because you were lying, don't do it no more. You try your best not to do it. And you can do it. You do not have to live a sinful life. It's all a choice. When you choose to live a sinful life, it's a choice. Because you know you can choose to live a life of righteousness. You have a choice. You are not too weak that you cannot walk away from sin. Don't let the devil fool you with that thought. That this is something that you got to do, that you were born into it. No. Jesus lived on this earth for over 30 some years and he sinned not one time. He showed us it can be done. He was an example for us. He showed us how to love one another as brothers and sisters. Have a, how, he showed us how, a, how to have a heart of compassion. To help one another. To care for one another. Not to talk about people. Not to put people down. But uplift. Help. He let us know that we should stack our riches and our treasures in heaven where no thief can come and take it away, where no moth no moth can, cannot ruin it. Stack your treasures in heaven, because where a man's heart is, that his treasures is also. Stack your treasures in heaven. Make sure that you got a mansion in heaven. Because any earthly mansion, any earthly homes can be destroyed. The house that God designed for you. With his hands can never be destroyed and no one can take it from you because God designed it especially for you. To your liking, to your taste, it's designed for you. Stack your treasures in heaven. All the earthly treasures will be destroyed one day. It's only for a moment. Stack eternal treasures. I just want you to know, my brothers and my sisters, that God is real. God is so real. And the love that God has for you, that he put in this word, that he loves you. It's real. Jesus Christ is real. Follow the way of Christ. 
believe believe truly believe in God he's real all right all right all right if this is your first time watching one of my videos I'd like to add you subscribe to the channel to help you grow also leave a comment down below for all my subscribers I thank you guys so much for your support to this channel May God bless and protect you if you left one of you, your family, friends, and loved ones in the name of Jesus Christ. Till next time, as always, keep God first. Stay prayed up. Y'all stay safe. I just felt the urge to make this video to let people know that God is real. It's all real. Heaven is real. Jesus is real. The love God has for you is real. The love Jesus has for you is real. Jesus really is the Son of God. He really died for your sins. Die for our sins so we can have life and have it more abundantly. Let God show you the way. May Jesus Lord of your life. Walk with Jesus. God bless you all. Remember, God loves you so much. God loves you so much.